All right. Uh, so, you know, lemon trade, as you may see from here, is a very basic service. You know, and you may wonder why a guy doing something for women's clothes. You know, and so our vision actually really is trying to be the glue layer of con you know connecting the online and offline world. Because if you think about you know any business that touch upon online and offline, such as eBay, right? You know, or you want to share something you know with your friend, what do you do the first time? Well, the first thing you do actually is you take a photo of what you have, right? Like you sell on eBay or on Craigslist, you take a photo, and then from there you start uploading you know editing, listing, or you know sweeping, you know swapping with the peers, etc. So we just really trying to focus on step one, which is to virtualize your personal belongings, right? You know, one way we think about us is that you know if Dropbox is for your digital goods, you know your photos, your videos, etc., and we really want to be Dropbox for your physical goods, you know, your furniture, your jewelry, your paintings at home, and we just start with uh, you know uh, your personal closet because we feel that's one of the you know kind of big things you know in, pe in many people's life. And there are lots of items. You have a lot of daily interactions with it, so that's really where we started. Um, we basically, you know, uh, so uh, product-wise, uh, we basically have two uh, pieces. So. Uh, So uh, we basically have a really basic uh, iPhone apps where basically serving as the photo uploaders. And uh, you know the only purpose of that is really for you to take photos. And every photo you take, you basically upload to our uh, server in the uh, cloud uh, instantly. And from there, basically, uh, you will have all your personal cloud is on the go with you, right? And also because everything is hosted in the cloud, you can basically also access from anywhere you know, on your tablet, you know, on your PCs, on your iPhones, even on your Android. And, uh, you know, if you uh, log into our website, basically what we offer is really, so, you know, the idea is uh, after you do the uploadings, right, we basically see, you know, we're going to offer a list of applications for you, right? So right now we offer a few very basic applications around your personal cloud, such as, you know, um, you can plan outfit, you know, with what you have, uh, you know, for example, if you go to our website, uh, let's say you want to, you know, uh, you want to create a new uh, look, you know, from from what you upload so far. So basically, you can say, I want to uh, looking for, let's say, my. Uh, uh, you can basically just like you know, uh, drag and drop, and you can, uh, you know, really basic, and basically you can have a uh, outfit done, and then. You can save it, and then uh, you can go back. And uh, if you want, you can put that in a calendar. So in that sense, you know we have users basically using this feature either as a planner, you know, this basic planner uh, week in advance, to so make sure you know they don't wear the same thing or similar you know, outfit for the week, <laughs> right? And also we have a lot of uh, users actually will do that more like a back, uh, like a back feeder, meaning they don't plan in advance, but they actually when they back home, you know. From their day, actually, they will do the uh, recording things. So they know, okay, this is what I wear on Monday, Tuesday, etc. So we see many people using many different uh, use cases. And we also see people, uh, you know, in a much more straightforward way, as you may see, this is from our you know, internal dashboard. Is we also see lots of users, we also actually just take a photo straight from their mirror. And basically using us as one of their ways to record their personal lives, right? You know, uh, you know, because you know, this is the way the people using that, you know, their you know daily life. They take photos of what they like. You know, kind of the, you know, these some uh, stars, and they also you know uh, so it's like Facebook. take a photo of what they do. And uh, one of the important thing for us is that you know the way I mentioned, the way are more like you know Dropbox for your physical goods is that everything you upload by default is private. So actually, we real we learned that. This actually is a key reason. Got many, many. Actually, uh, we have about you know, uh, without any marketing, we have about a couple thousand people. You know, uh, so far, mainly women from all over the U.S. And we basically see them uploading really a lot of things. You know, not only actually their personal closet, I mean shoes, you know, uh, clothes, but also we see them uploading their makeups. You know, their even their daily hairstyles. You know, their makeups, everything. And we also see people up, you know, taking photos from the mall. You know, 
or even from a book or from a magazine about what they like. Right? They're really trying to use this as kind of a way to uh, you know, uh, record their personal lives. Uh, about 30 seconds. Sure. Uh, so that's really it, you know, and our vision for the, uh, you know, for the company is really, you know, um, like I said, you know, to build up partnerships, you know, with all those uh, companies who may have interest to work with us as application layer. For example, you know, right, imagine you can, you know, basically sell your, sell your stuff, you know, on eBay just by one click, right, because you already have to go of it, right, just like one click, you know, I want to sell this pair of shoes on eBay, done, where right? we can push over, you know, through eBay API. Right. Imagine you know uh, we can work with those uh, you know uh, companies who is trying to do this like a peer to peer swap service, right? You know for girls. Uh, well, then we can say, look, you know, we are have their stuff uploaded, right? Then they just be, you know can come on and become another you know partner on that. And uh, the last thing is that we also trying to work with you know retailers and designers like those brands, because literally we are the one actually have a cross merchant, cross channel purchase data. Right. Imagine, you know, many people actually, all the retailers don't even know what you bought, what you purchased from them. No one really knows, you know, what you purchased from their competitors at an individual level. And that, well, we know, right? So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah. So, uh, questions? So, uh, you said that, you know, this can work as a planner uh, for your wardrobe, for yeah. example. So are you uh, allowing people to classify, say if I have a trip coming, or two trips coming, one right. is a personal, one is a business trip, and one is a pleasure trip. Right. Uh, do you allow the clothing or whatever is there to be classified as professional and casual, so that you know when I select a wardrobe for a business uh -huh. trip, it can just pop up only the professional wear, and I can then yes. you know, select from that? Yes, yes. So the question basically is, do we allow people to, you know, uh, plan their outfit for different purposes? So yes. So, so basically it's done by. So basically we have another feature. Uh, you know, right. Basically it's on our website. You can, you know, basically add whatever labels you want. So you can label things for the for business trips. You know, we see people, you know, label things by season, like winter, like spring. We see a lot of people basically by, uh, you know, where they go, like Hawaii versus, you know, uh, Denver, things like that. So yeah, basically that's the idea, right? The idea is basically, well, that's your stuff. And in real life, you only have one way to organize it, right? Now, in the, you know, once you virtualize it, you can organize whatever you want, right? And also, you know, by the way, also see, you know, we also got our post by like, you know, personal statics, right? They are like, okay, you know, I want to use our service to virtualize my client's personal product. So when they need me, I can actually plan their outfit, you know, like being the trip, whatever, on your website virtually, which then she can access from her phone or computer. Does that answer? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, any other questions? Is there another question back there? Are you guys pa partnering with any of the fashion brands yet? Oh, no, we are not. We just launched this whole thing in last December. Cool. So yeah, it's really just alpha. Uh, we haven't got time to uh, into that yet. We got we got queries, but you know we are, you know, um, I'm the busy. I'm the only full time guy, and I have uh, two part, two other part time. So it's more like bandwidth issue. Okay. Yeah. Are you funded? Uh, we are not. We are bootstrapped so far. Well, we have raised the 60k from two friends. Uh, that's about it. Uh, otherwise, it's on our own. I have one yeah. question. So, given that this is in the cloud, um, is there a use case for collaborating with, say, a group of friends from across the U.S. Mm -hmm. are going to go on vacation? Sure. And all of them, I mean, you know, want to wear similar kind of clothing so mm -hmm. that one person doesn't stand out or whatever. Right. Is there any collaboration possibility or use case to do anything like that? That this is the wardrobe I'm going to carry. What are you going to carry? Sure. Or so the question. Like sure. So the question is basically, you know, do we allow people to collaborate with our friend? You know, uh, so that's on the roadmaps. Uh, so yes. Yeah, so the idea, basically, we see that as another application, right? It's again, you know, once you have this virtual labs, right? You can even have your friend looking at what you have and make an audit for you, you know, etc. Yes. Uh, you know, we just haven't gone there yet. Time for one more. Another question. Cool. Thanks All for right. your demo. Thanks.